Okay, not too much happening this week. Just kind of recuperating from all the cuts and bruises and sore back. And now my knee's down in the dumps. Wah. But anyway, we're just doing a little bit of yard maintenance. Trying to get all the overgrowth cleaned up. And kind of get this place organized a little bit. But... Somehow the brush piles caught on fire. Uh, there's a burn ban until April 30th, but somehow the brush piles caught on fire, so they're gone. So they're getting replaced about as quick as they get built up. But Goy's getting her mom's house kind of cleaned up and uh, gonna have a lot of mangoes. Everybody's been picking the low the low hanging fruit but you can see it's pretty there it's pretty well loaded up higher but they like the green mangoes so everybody's been kind of cutting up the mangoes there the main house got the front kind of cleaned up and still trying to get a couple stumps dug up but slowly but surely it's coming around. Got the big brush piles in front. Gone. That's what the new patio kind of looks like. But all that's finally clear. Cleaned up, had big ash pile there. Got uh, that big tree there in the corner there, gone. Now I just got all these little, I've been working on these little ones. A little bit at a time. Uh, getting the form stuff cleaned up. That built me a little temporary ramp to get the motorcycle up on the ramp. Uh, gonna go order block today. Need about uh, 520 blocks to do what we're gonna do. So we'll go get that ordered. Uh, that's not the block is pretty cheap. I want to put a steel door in in that room right there to kind of make it a secure room. So that's like 200 bucks for that door. And the bathroom door they just put in little PVC bathroom doors, so it's under 100 bucks for the door. So I think it's under 50 actually for the jam and door. All together we've already got a toilet we have to go find a sink for the bathroom and a sink for the kitchen uh, and then we'll be ready to go I'm gonna start working on the plumbing here shortly uh, still got two of these little stubborn stubborn pieces of metal that kind of got sandwiched in the form work but I got Two pieces left to get out. I just haven't had the energy to mess with them. I'll get them out. But uh, got all the welds touched up so they don't rust. Really should paint the whole thing, but uh, I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> lack of energy right now. But yeah, it's starting to shape up. We're getting everything cleared out and then. That's just leftover concrete. So that'll get another couple inches poured on top of it. And uh, that'll save us some money in the future. But yeah, it's coming along. Uh, and like I said, it's been a slow week. Just kind of taking it easy and trying to save a little money this week. It, as I've said in the past videos, the budget's a little bit. A little bit uh, over by about a month so I need to kind of slow down and recoup and by ordering the block that gives us time to kind of take it easy this month we won't have a whole lot of expenditures a little bit of labor here and there because I'm I'm not gonna be able to lay too much block not bending over anyway um, but yeah getting a little firewood for built up get my fire pit going 
here in a little while. So, yeah, jackfruits are coming along. So, got mangoes and jackfruit and tamarind. All kinds of, every time I try to cut down a tree, Goy tells me no because she eats it. The flowers, she makes tea and this and that, and which I guess is a good thing, but uh, this will all be under a couple feet of, hopefully I'll be able to get some uh, wood chips. There's a place down the road that just grinds it up to take to the paper mills, I think, either paper mills or to the lumber company for chipboard, but I'm not sure where it goes, but hopefully I can get several trucks of that, but yeah, it's coming along, we'll start laying block, maybe the end of this week, beginning of next week, and then things will really start to shape up, so, gonna do the last redo on the plumbing, reroute this along the edge here, and tie it in back there because I got uh, a sink drain well that's already plumbed in all that's I just got to take it back to the back back there and tee it in and then the drain will go off into that ditch over here on the mom's side so it's coming along a little bit here and there PVC's cheap here I rework things multiple times and these valves uh, already break and spray and so she's having leaks all over her mom's house because it's so old and they've got it bandaged up literally with uh, inner tubes and so she's springing leaks all over due to the pressure from the pump so they're not used to having pressure in those pipes and it's been sitting empty for oh maybe five years since she's actually been living here so uh, yeah. All right. Enough rambling. See ya.